This is so crazy and I don't know how to think or what to imagine about it. And the last time I had about the same situation, I didn't feel much. It was more of like, eh, kind of deal. However, this time, this time, it's a little more fearful, anxious, and I really don't know what or how to feel about it. As a young, stupid, yet ambitious man myself, it sounds strange to even say that by myself, but yes, I am turning 30 in 30 days. So I decided to make a song about turning 30. On the first day, I wrote every single idea that I had down. And eventually what I came up with was this absolutely ridiculous idea of combining symphonic orchestra, operatic elements, and gospel, and hip-hop. At this point, I didn't know how or what to do, to be honest. But for whatever reason it was, I wanted to do this. On day two, I laid down the very first musical idea on my logic. To be honest, I already had this idea in my head for quite some time, so this part was not as difficult as I thought it would be. part in this project was to write lyrics. Honestly, this is something that I had never done before in my life. Even though I created and composed so many songs, writing what I want to say or my own feeling in a most creative and musical way at the same time definitely opened up new door for me. Okay, so I have been writing this for about two weeks. I think it's become what I want it to be. Uh, there's a little more to kind of like uh, revise, but overall, the structure wise, uh, it fits to my project, and I think the rest is just refining everything and, and potentially change some uh, few words if it causes any problem later on when I'm re going to record. But as I mentioned, I think overall the structure and what it is now is just perfect in my own sense. Uh, of course, there's a lot that I can get constructive, constructive criticism on, but so far I'm quite happy with what it became. Let's see where this is going. <laughs> I've seen possessed all the time was faster. Every day I wonder what did I even master? When... <sighs> So now you understand why I was writing lyrics to this song. To be honest, 
singing alone is difficult, but rapping is even more difficult than I expected. Some of the words that I tried to pronounce in my own head made so much sense, but once I start actually rapping, the pronunciation or rhyming sometimes doesn't align to the music, so I had to make several changes throughout this practice. Okay, so today I have an important mission, which I'm not necessarily good at accomplishing, and I honestly, over the years, I kind of sort of kept avoiding, but uh, in this project, for some reason, I created and this part is such an important part, uh, so I have to do it and basically make it sound bigger and a little more natural. Uh, I am going to record my voice. So I set up my microphones and everything is ready to go. And let's cross my fingers and see what happens. So what I'm doing here is to create a sense of choir. Of course I cannot hire 100 different people to record a voice, so I had to create choir out of my own voice. By the way, I think I recorded in total 36 to 40 times. Today is second day of vocal recording. I'm about to going. I'm about to going to. I'm about to record my voice uh, today. This part is absolutely important part that I cannot mess up, and I've been practicing a little while, uh, so I hope everything goes well. But this room is all like a concrete brick wall room, so the echo is quite crazy high uh, and I'm afraid of recording in such a room and to be honest I don't have any place that I can go any recording room that I can go to nearby so I have to come up with some sort of creative idea to record my voice and this is absolutely junkiest but I think this is going to work Okay, so this is my vocal recording booth. It's literally two, uh, I think this is IKEA chairs. Two chairs stuck like this. This is like where you sit and I flip the other one and put it on top and I put a blanket on top and I'm going to put my microphone Call me crazy So yesterday I recorded my voice singing for my own project and I was listening to that last night and I realized it sounded terrible in many different ways so I decided to record again in a different room which is my bedroom and of course I don't have any vocal booth or anything that um, basically avoid any noise reflection so I created my own vocal booth which is literally just a blanket on top of my close it hanging down the microphone <laughs> it's it's so junky but i hope this works yeah thankfully i was in a flow state for entire time of this production so every single production was was done in about 
twenty to twenty five days. The rest was to mix and master. Well, this is not the perfect mix. This is not the perfect master, but I poured my heart and soul. And honestly, I'm quite happy with the outcome and what this song became. So, I hope you enjoy the song titled Call Me Crazy.